You probably shouldn't be here. Doctors, nurses, volunteers fighting disease, gore fans, regular people, welcome. Herring Houdini. It's me, you idiot. Okay. Something's fishy. Why are you here? Why are any of us here? The life cycle of the salmon. I am very happy you're here. And when all my friends hear that I have three real life orphans, <laughs> they'll be sick with jealousy. When... People are looking at us. It's probably because we're new. It's because your home was destroyed in a fire. Cannelloni! You wouldn't dare. This is dry clean only. What my wife means is that we hope you'll feel safe and secure. Jerem, don't tell them silly things like that. Is that a new hat? Makes your head look funny. I already gave you half of my burrito. Je m'appelle. You must be a very self-actualized person. Well, I do eat a lot of yogurt. Life is thickly sown with thorns, and I know no other remedy than to pass quickly through them. Voltaire said that. I thought we expelled that French kid for smoking. Showtime. So let's go. Time. Let's go someplace spiffy and schmancy. Someplace in. I say we burn him at the stake. I want your energy dumped on my head so it can run down my face like a lotion. You think we can get back to 667 Dark Avenue? Not until you get through the entire life cycle of the salmon. <laughs> the lovely girl, sweet as a butterscotch buttercup. She has two living parents. Rutabaga. <gasps> They're orphans? Que pasa? Yes, I'm allergic to orphans. Is it their dust? Yes, yes, or their ashes. It's, it's, it's clogs up my whole, um, what is the word for it? Glands. Life. Girls were falling all over me in school, and not just because I would extend my leg when they walked by. Egad, I know that ankle anywhere. Because when you're laughing, you're... Okay, when you're laughing, you're taking in oxygen, or whatever, and that oxygen goes, um... You really do tie a beautiful bow, Esme. Mm, I just thought she needed a little sprucing up. <laughs> you really are starting to grow as a thespian. Thespian? Well, I do love horses. What language did you have it translated into, please? The one you speak most fluently? Yeah, well, 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 I speak all of them hella fluently. They're in that shack. Did she say shack? Nobody said orphan shack. The art rat. Caught like a trap in a rat. I can't sleep! These dark, dank walls are closing in. I call to the spirits of the jail cell. Save me! Save me! How long has it been? The days turn to months. It's been eight minutes. Do you want some tea? Thank Houdini. A completely legitimate business with no secret agenda behind it whatsoever. Welcome to Herring Houdini, home of pickled fish. Everything here has been prepared for you. And very quickly, but not because we got a phone call five minutes ago. For the children, we offer a tour of the kitchen. Where they'll probably not be thrown into a burlap sack. And for the adults. Vodka martinis. Which don't have any sleeping potion in them at all. You know what these are? Uh, bracelet things of justice. Alone! Desperate, defeated. These are words I thought I'd never use except when talking about other people. I. Thumbs up. Oh. Right, because you don't have. I think you look beautiful. I wish I had skin like yours. I wish I was wearing your skin. Happy now. Today is the first day of the life of your rest. Right. First life of the rest of your day. No, no. Today. <coughs> Buy on the candy. Buy on the candy. Today is the first day of the life of your rest. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. I said it the right way the first time. We can't simply burn people at the stake whenever we want. We're civilized people. How about after supper? As Dante once said. Bang. Dante never said that. Far away. 
Rule number 8,675 clearly states citizens aren't allowed to use their mouths for recreation. I say we bu -bu -da -bu -bu -da burn them all! Aaron was captured, but his butterflies were safe from government questioning. A grown man unfolding paper. How amazing. Because a cheerful attitude is the most effective tool against sickness. I started on antibiotics for... Well, he said the tank got cold, it was filled with smoke and fire, and then he saw a ghost from the past. You know, magic. Behold, corn! Something every normal person can eat. Can you eat corn, normal person? You know I love it when you talk about my mucous membranes. Uh, I'm not sure which I love more, your membranes or your mucus. As far as my research has shown, a huge cloud of dust is never placed higher than 25th in a beauty pageant. Your culture is so interesting, not like those other countries that make me feel guilty or uncomfortable. <laughs> Plan number B. Overt your eyes, unless you're brave enough to handle the sight of a man shaving with two hands. Uh, what is that thing? I think it's some kind of mechanical device. <gasps> Parsley soda? <gasps> Spirits work in mystical ways. Also, Madame Lulu recently have checkup. Why don't you eat here with your boring husband? I will take the children to the herring restaurant for kidnapping. I mean hors d'oeuvres. It smells like disinfectant here. I know, I'm hungry too. Just hang for chips. Oh, yeah, is this was large enough for, how do you say, suffocating rich person? Hello. I'd like to check out a child. <laughs> Spines! A scarf. How about two scarves? Three scarves? Darling, scarf. you're just scaring him. All right, fine. One more. Pop, there's your dove. It's dead, thanks. The ancient art of sorcery. We need to blend in with plain, normal, upstanding, heartfelt, decent, simple, dependable, respectable people. Look in your hearts and ask yourselves, what do you really want? To burn children. I love a happy ending. It's like Wuthering Heights, which I never read. It is the sound of a long scream in the dark. Just tell me what you want, what you really, really want. Oh, I'll tell you what I want. What I really, really want. It's just handsome foreign man and pretty lady dragging someone unconscious, please. Oh, for a moment there, I thought it might be something suspicious. Ah, you can't open this box until you give me the money. That's illegal. What's illegal is auctioning off children. Not everywhere. Hi, darling, you're on the lam. Oh, contrary. I'm dead. Eat this ear of corn, you two-headed freak. Yes. Yes, that seems credible. Mr. Siren was a lepidopter. A word which usually means a person who studies butterflies. In Mr. Siren's case, it also meant one who is being pursued by government officials. Is this legal? Don't spoil the fun, boy. Let's have children. Look, Tom, you can't look. look. What do you think, violence fans? Let's see 